Uh, this is a video response to Ave's Town Pump CNC Ideas video. Uh, what he said was we could uh, use his CNC machine to make a product and he would do some prototyping for us. Well, uh, this is my idea. It comes in two parts. It's These are uh, 3D printed. Um, this, I would, this idea was conceived I think around about the 14th of October. So it's very fortuitous that Ave wants to do some prototyping because uh, it's just at this prototyping stage now. Right, let me explain. It comes in two parts. Top part, bottom part. So there's two bits of machining to do. Um, and what it's for, it's for making space frame structures. Imagine this piece of wood as a strut. It could be wood, it could be metal, it could be um, a number of things. Solid metal, tubular metal, timber, bamboo, um, sticks, anything. Uh, this, uh, These two components here, that's all you have to machine, those two components, make it possible to join um, you just join them into the end and it makes it possible to join any number of struts at any angle. Let me just show you. You can do space frame like this. You can do, uh, let me just like that. That would be like a ridge roof. Uh, pyramids, domes. Um, it was designed for geodesic domes. But it has, uh, now that's four. You can see there's four there. This one's five, so it works exactly the same. There's five there. You can do structures that unfold. So this is this is five. Let me try and get it five like that. Again, you can do space frame by having some depth to it, to it. So you can these can effectively be joined at any angle. The problem it solves is um, when joining anything metal, wood, anything at a, at a joint, you get uh, problems with what you have, the angles you cut and everything like that. And it can be, well, uh, frustrating for people, let's say, unless you're an expert jointer. So with this tiny bracket, uh, you don't have to worry about any joints at all. You just cut them off straight. See, let me just see, that's totally square edged. You just fit it on, the, on a square edge, and most people I find can cut, cut roughly a square edge. So you don't have to worry about it, and you can join any number of struts together at any angle. Look at that. Now to do this joint, you need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10. You need 10 uh, brackets to do that joint. Uh, so. I'm, su I'm sure your machine will have a repeat function on it, but you need. Uh, it would be cool to uh, knock a few out. I thought aluminium would work great. Um, let me know. I don't have no idea how Abe's supposed to find this video, but I, sure, I thought I'd shove it up anyway. Uh, so thanks for watching. It's just a quickie, uh, and I'll let you know how it goes. Cheers out.